Just open HD, I don't have much daylight and I uh, just wanted to try to get a test in but have the OSD here. This is open HD. I'm trying to compare this to the original uh, 1.6 Wi-Fi broadcast. So I'm going to get to work here. Uh, I have a mission set. I was going to just try running it for both. Um, it's probably out about a half mile or so. Stabilize flight mode. Pre-on hardware safety switch. Mission. Uh, come right here. Pre on hardware safety switch. miles per hour. Take off to the next one right here. Pre on hardware safety switch. Pre-on hardware safety switch. So kind of just fly out and back 160 feet. Pre-on hardware safety switch. Okay. All right, that's saved. Loiter flight mode. Position hold flight mode. Circle flight mode. Return to launch flight mode. Auto flight mode. Stabilize flight mode. Okay. I have a single, uh, I'm testing with a Pi 3, uh, not a B plus, because I'm trying to test the original Wi-Fi broadcast and open HD. And uh, the original Wi-Fi broadcast doesn't work on the B plus, so between the monitor, um, power, the uh, USB tethering, I really don't have any extra USB ports, so pull up my camera here. So I'm just testing with a single uh, ubiquity on each side, and I have the IB Crazy uh, V antenna sort of rigged up there. My, my custom camera cable and the gimbal. Gotta love Velcro. All right, well, no GoPro. Stabilize flight mode.
position hold flight mode. Stabilize flight mode. Loiter flight mode. Armed. Try to do a lot at once here. I hate how Q ground control keeps having to load up. Loiter flight mode. Alright, I'll keep that on. Now I'm going to put it in uh, auto. Auto flight mode. Everything seems to be going well so far. I still have gimbal control. I'm showing about 55, 56 dB. Right now on my regular OSD, we're at 200 feet, 1,100 feet away. Controls are still good. Let me see if I can yaw while we're flying. Yes. Signal hasn't dropped out yet. Had a little bit of stutter there. I'm running at data rate 4 right now. I'm, uh, things are going pretty good right now. 2,000 feet away, so almost half a mile. I don't have a real clear line of sight at the moment. And it's 75, negative 75 dB. Still have a good link, 2,300 feet. Pull up the map here. We're almost at waypoint number six, which will be about 3,000 feet away. Uh, 65 to 70 dB, again, I'm running with a single um, Wi-Fi station on the transmitting side and a single Wi-Fi station on the ground side, which normally I'm running diversity, but right now this is working really well. Um, as a matter of fact, loiter flight mode. I'm going to go back into loiter and I'm going to see if I can fly a little farther away here. because that went well. Now I know that my artificial horizon and um,
one second. My artificial horizon and my home arrow are backwards. I forgot to correct that like I usually have to do. So I'm at 270 feet now. I'm just going to keep flying backwards. See if we can get to a mile. Things are looking good. I'm going to adjust my gimbal down. This home arrow. That home arrow right now, the lower tip, that's right where we took off from. Oh, you can't see my main OSD. Just the top, the farthest point of the green you can see in the distance there. So I'm at 350 feet. I'm just going to start flying backwards. And actually, the antenna is behind the drone right now, so if we can keep the signal good, that's a pretty good indicator. And turn around. Okay. Keep flying forward a little bit. Not bad. Starting to get a little break up now. There we go. Wanted to add the flight distance. You know what I wanted to add distance from home. There we go. I don't know why I'm not seeing it. All right, now I'm going to try to test fail safe here. I'm going to. Uh, unscrew the ten antennas uh, for the ground slightly to drop the signal out and see if uh, RTL was engaged. Smart return to launch flight mode. And it did. Enabled a uh, smart RTL. Stabilize flight mode. Loiter flight mode. Auto flight mode. Return to launch flight mode. I tried that smart RTL. I don't know why it was descending there for a moment. Uh, I hope this video comes out okay. <laughs> it started to descend, and I don't know if it was, it, it's an error, because I got three slashes when the failsafe was triggered. Um, I don't know if anyone knows anything about smart RTL or not. Go to my camera here. So I have it in RTL.
Still getting those CPU spikes. I don't remember that happening with 1.6. I could be wrong though. There she is. right overhead. All right, now I'm back home. And again, I'm just using a screen capture on my Android for this. Um, Now I'm just going to fly a little more stabilize flight mode aggressively. position hold flight mode stays together Oops. That's like 150 feet right now 2.2 volts. There we go. So I'm trying to just stress test it, draw some more amps, drawing like 45, 50 amps right now as I'm flying. And I'm not as high, so I just want to see how strong the signal stays. And so far, so good. I'm kneeling down on the ground, flying away. It's 1,500 feet away, uh, flying towards the football stadium there. 200 feet. There we go. Gain some altitude here. And it's bitter cold out, so I'm going to head back. And I'm not even going to test 1.6 because, I mean, honestly, this is about the same result that I got uh, with 1.6 flying in the past. Um, I'm on Wi Fi. I'm on the cha uh, channel um, 2484. This is just the first time I've really been able to come out and fly this thing more than 500 feet away. You know what? Screw it. Let's fly a little farther. This crew is about 20 miles an hour. my gimbal. I need to get the weight correct on the gimbal. Oops. Back. There's 3,000 feet. This is just with a single omnidirectional on the ground, so pretty happy with it so far. Alright, so that's 4,000 feet. Circle flight mode. Loiter flight mode. Flying back now. I mean, the control is uh, I mean, perfect. Put my gear up. Okay. 
Auto flight mode. Return to launch flight mode. Low battery. 29% remaining. Low battery, 28% remaining. Low battery, 27% remaining. I might need to work on calibrating my uh, power module. I don't think I'm drawing this much current as it's saying. But Low battery. Let's get open. Twenty-six percent remaining. All right. About two thousand feet away. Low battery. Twenty-five percent remaining. Low battery. Twenty-four percent remaining. I have to say, I mean, this is about as good as I can ask with a single receiver and an Omni antenna. I feel like I didn't even Low battery, 23% remaining. So. Still getting those CPU, uh, the CPU usage spiking near 60 Low battery, 22% remaining. Low battery, 21% remaining. Maybe the power module is right. Here we are. Okay. Well, I'm happy with that. Great. See ya.